Hello and welcome to jasonnewland.com. My name is Jason Newland. Please only listen to this when you can safely close your eyes. This is uh, relaxation hypnosis for stress, anxiety, panic attacks. Please only listen when you can safely close your eyes. So what I would thought I would do today is kind of a short session. And it's going to be one of my special banging the microphones. Stop that. <laughs> special exercise that you can do. Now, I'm going to ask you to close your eyes. But I suppose technically you don't need to. You can do this in other ways. Uh, with your eyes open. I suppose it's the only other way, isn't it? Eyes closed or eyes open. But I'm going to ask you to close your eyes. Just for the sake of this recording. And I want you to... I guess sit down in a chair would be the ideal situation with your feet on the ground and your hands on your knees resting you know your arms resting with your hands on your knees of course if that's physically uncomfortable or impossible for whatever reason then you know improvise do something as simple as similar as possible now I want you to focus on your body I want you to focus more importantly on the stress in your body and I want you to notice whereabouts in your body the stress is where you can feel it the most scratch my ear there so where do you feel it the most in your body I mean I have a tendency at the moment because I've got some uh, problems with my lower back and I seem to find myself very tense in my lower back and it is causing me stress um, and other you know emotions connected with uh, kind of what's going on is like, oh dear, am I, you know, I've just turned 50 and suddenly I'm walking around like a 90 year old, but that's my issue to deal with. You may have tension in your shoulders, you may have tension in your knees, in your legs, hands. So we're not talking about physical pain necessarily but this can also be used for that as well the physical discomfort stress is uncomfortable it's I don't think it's uh, I don't think there's any problems calling it pain because it is painful it's emotionally painful and it can be physically painful as well especially if that tension is almost cramping up your muscles that's pain on various levels so this is a technique to reduce that physical discomfort in your body and it's something that you can do over and over again until you're feeling at a level that you're happy with Okay, so here we go. 
I need to focus on that part. I'm going to focus on the, my lower back because at the moment that's the only place like I feel a little bit in my eyes. Okay, so I do feel a little bit in my eyes, um, my eyelids. I've got my eyes closed. I always do this with you when I do it. Yeah, it's really only my lower back, a little bit of my buttocks as well, actually. So the, the lower back and my buttocks seem to be, I mean, they are connected, aren't they, obviously? But they seem to physically, um, the most discomfort is in the actual lower back itself. But it spreads up a bit as well. So it's not just right at the low lower bit. Now I realise I'm talking about my own stress and tension. The reason I'm doing that is because I want you to get in touch with yours. But I can't tell you where yours is because I don't know. So if you was in the room with me, I would be focusing solely on your body where the tension is there and I'd be saying I focus on your shoulders and you know but I can't do that in this situation so I'm gonna I'm gonna need your help with me to join me in this exercise so as you focus right focus on the part of your body where the most stress is at the moment even if you've got stress in other parts, just focus on that one, that one part. And in your mind, I want you to draw a line around it, or a circle around it, or a shape, whatever the shape is, an outline in whatever colour you want it to be. Okay? Just so you can separate it from the rest of your body just so you can know where it is and know that it's that feeling that stress that tension has got nothing to do with the rest of your body it's just in that part and that's what we're focusing on it's almost like a a tiny little island on its own surrounded by sea and you'd need a boat to get to it if you wanted to get to it from another island nearby. Okay, so just that outline. So what I'm doing myself, I'm not focused on the whole of my lower back, just focusing on the, the part that's the most uh, obvious as far as physical, physical sensations. So I'm outlining that now. It's the left side, quite low down. And as I do that, it's starting to feel a little bit itchy. Now, there's different types of focusing. When you focus on a part of your body... Uh, you know, if you're feeling angry or you're just really, really annoyed with the tension or whatever, then it's a different sensation to how you feel when you close your eyes and you're listening to me, so you're feeling more relaxed anyway, and you've done an outline of that part. And now as you focus on that part of your body that's outlined, the reason it may start to feel a little bit different, that mine's feeling a bit itchy, not itchy enough that I want to scratch it, almost feel like the itch is inside, almost in the muscles, not skin level. It 
And part of the reason for this would be that as you focus on it in a positive space, you know, with a positive mental attitude, the blood flow, well, basically your blood is sent, fresh, clean, healing blood is sent to that part of your body. That's just what your body does. Unfortunately, sometimes when in maybe a day-to-day -day situation, I might be thinking, oh, my damn back. But I'm never specific. And I'll be maybe walking. Like the other day, I was struggling to walk. and But it wasn't, it was my knees, my back. Everything was kind of out of kilter because of my posture being very bad due to the uncomfortableness of my back. And mentally, I was in a very bad space. I was just very negative. All I wanted to do was moan. All I wanted to do was just shout and just, you know, get annoyed. But sitting down, relaxing, focusing just on a particular part of that tension, of that discomfort that's outlined. Focusing just on that part, literally with your mind focusing, and perhaps you can see it in your mind's eye you know what the different parts of your body look like. So you can just imagine whatever part that is, just looking at it and seeing the outline that you've drawn on that part of your body. It's quite weird. I just imagined drawing an outline on my right chest, right the uh, right part of my chest. And my chest started itching. Even though I've got no tension there at all. It's just that's where the focus went. It's almost like that tension moved from my lower back to the muscles in my chest. And I've moved it back to my to my lower back so I don't want it in my chest what we're going to do though is now I'd like you to imagine that shape rising above your skin rising above your body and maybe you can see that outline uh, shining or something like that just so you can see it and it's just rising above your body out of your skin and it moves over and it lands into your left hand now of course don't do this if, if the body part is your hand to start with so maybe move that to your feet but if for this situation move it to your left hand And focus on that shape. Maybe on the top, depending on how your hands are resting. Imagine that filling your hand. So it no longer has to be in a shape. It can just be the whole of your hand. And notice how your left hand feels. Maybe that itchiness or a different type of sensation is in your left hand. You can just feel it there. I've noticed, it's very strange, but I've noticed that my lower back wants my attention but 
it's a feeling of comfort. I can feel my lower back really relaxing. I'm going to keep my focus on my left hand. But the relief is so nice. It's hard to ignore it. And although the the sensation, a sensation, is in my left hand, almost a tingling, itchy kind of sensation. It's not pain. It's not really stress so much. It's an energy, some kind of energy. So you could leave that in your hand there. And now I want you to focus on a part of your body that feels really relaxed, really relaxed. So I'm just going to search for a part. My jaw feels relaxed, feels very relaxed, even though I'm talking. My jaw does feel relaxed. So I'm going to focus on my jaw. I'll just do an outline of my jaw. It's almost like drawing on my face, you know. And just the shape of my jaw as I focus just on that sense of relaxation. And it does actually increase. It does feel... feels really nice, actually. feels very calm. Very loose. And it'd feel a lot looser if I wasn't talking. But it just feels nice. There's not really any kind of itch in there for me. There's a lightness... And of course that sensation may be different. But my left hand feels very heavy. And my jaw feels very light. So I'm just going to imagine that shape moving. You know, that outline of my jaw moving out of my jaw, out of my face. And then just landing into my right hand and you can do that for yourself wherever it is in your body moving that up out of your body that relaxation and just allowing it to just rest into your right hand now my right hand feels really really light And something weird has happened because my right hand seems to feel different as well. It doesn't feel as heavy as it was. So what we're going to do is just make sure we can get all of the feeling possible in the left hand by focusing on it again. Remembering that that's where the tension is, that's where the maybe the pain is, you know, that's where those... That energy connected to the stressed part of your body is. That's where it resides in this moment in your left hand. And then moving over to your right hand as you focus on that. In fact, if anything, my right hand does feel a little bit tingly in the fingers. But it's just a gentle one gentle feeling and I've got similar feelings actually in my stomach it's almost as if my body is choosing your body is choosing the feelings of relaxation I guess that makes sense doesn't it really if you were going to choose 
what would you choose? You, you choose to feel calm and to feel nice and you know pleasantly relaxed. So what I'm going to do now, and I'll ask you to do this as well, is just to press your hands together. Now, just, you know, in a second, there's no hurry. There's no hurry to do any of this. Partly the reason I'm not in a hurry is because I'm noticing that other parts of my body are really starting to relax more deeply, especially my shoulders for some reason. And the rest of my face, my eyes, definitely more relaxed than they were. So now it's time to just put your hands together. So what I'm going to do is count down from five down to one. And when I say one, you can push your hands together. And what will happen is that sense of deep relaxation will spread and mix together. And positive always wins over negative. Five, four, three, two, one. Now lift your hands if you haven't already done so and just push them together. I'm going to count from 10 down to 1 as you hold them together and allow that energy to do its work. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, Two, one, and drop your hands to your knees again. And notice how much more you feel relaxed, not just throughout your whole body and mind but especially in that space that you'd outlined earlier on and just for good measure we're going to put our hands together one more time for a count of ten this time, the feelings of relaxation in your body and mind will become ten times more relaxed with each number you count. Alright, push your hands together now. Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Five, four, three, two, one. And drop your hands to your knees. And breathe in that sense of comfort as you appreciate just how relaxed you've become. 
so relaxed and calm. It feels so nice to let go completely. And that is the end of this recording. And you can repeat this as often as you choose. You can listen to this and choose a different part of your body. And every time you do it, you'll feel more relaxed. And every time you hear my voice, a sense of comfort will spread through your body and mind. So thank you for listening. I'll speak to you next time. Remember to be kind to yourself because you deserve to be happy. Lots of love. Bye.